In this video, we're going to look at two sentences where there's something wrong. So see if you can spot the mistake. Then we'll look at what we can do about it, how we should solve it. And after that, there will be some practice. At the end, there will be something about usage as well. So let's get started. What's wrong with this sentence? Did you spot it? It was went. So I didn't went. So after didn't, you use the type one. So be didn't go, didn't eat, didn't sing, etc. Okay, here's another what's wrong. So can you spot the mistake? Okay, it's not what did you eat yesterday, but what did you eat? So again, it's the same mistake as the previous one. So when you got didn't or did, it is always followed by a type one. So here are some chunks that can help you. This is especially with the first problem. So I didn't plus type one. I still didn't plus type one. She also didn't plus type one. I think he didn't plus type one. And they only didn't plus type one. So the last one is a little bit different to the others. But we won't go into it today. So what can you do about this? What can you do? With this problem, it's very easy. Ask yourself the question, what did I do yesterday? And do that for about a week. So maybe put the question somewhere on your computer or somewhere where you're going to see it every day and come up with four or five examples. So for example, for me, I didn't drive a car yesterday. I didn't go shopping yesterday. I didn't eat breakfast yesterday. I didn't go swimming yesterday. I didn't walk in a forest yesterday. Okay, and for the second one, which was the did in the question, a good practice could be something like this. So you can see a verb table. This is the verb table with four types in it. And you look at the type ones. So actually ignore the first one, be, because didn't be is very rare. But buy, come, do, drive, drink, eat, fall, find, get, etc. Uh, all goes with didn't. So what we're going to do, I'm going to flash a verb on the screen. Then we'll give you about 10 seconds to come up with a question. And I will give you one or two examples for each one. Okay, so the first one is make. So can you make a question with did and make? Good, go. Pause the video. And when you're ready, play. Uh, what did you make? Very simple one. What did you make yesterday? Uh, another one was how much did you make? So this make is about money. How much did you make? You sold your TV, how much did you make? Okay, our second one is Drink. So pause the video, make at least one question, did and drink. And then I will give you a couple of examples. First one, very easy. What did you drink? If I give a time, what did you drink yesterday evening? How much did you drink? Okay, what's our next one? Go. Okay, you know the procedure, pause the video, make a question, play. All right, simple one, where did you go yesterday? Uh, another one, how far did you go? Okay, what's our next one? Four. Okay, this is uh, maybe a bit more tricky. So, where did you fall? Oh, and it could also be, how far did you fall? Why did you fall? Okay, if...
It's slightly different because you, I think you need a person in there, most of the time anyway. So uh, what did you give Lucy? How much did you give to Lucy? Okay, and our last one is drive. Where did you drive yesterday? How far did you drive? How long did you drive for? A little bonus one at the end. I've noticed, in Taiwan at least, that some people will use didn't uh, in, the, in the wrong way. They, they intend to say something else. For example, they might say, oh, I, I didn't drink coffee. When their real meaning is, I don't drink coffee. So they, when you, if you say, I didn't drink coffee, most people will think, okay, is that yesterday, last week? But they won't think it's for now because you use didn't. But if you saw so Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, don't drink coffee, then say don't drink coffee. So if it's something that you do in general, use don't. I don't smoke. If you say I didn't smoke, uh, people think you smoke. So just maybe it's specifically for Taiwan and I presume China as well. There's this usage of using didn't to mean something that they don't do in general. Okay, so that's today's lesson. So use the chunks. Uh, the chunks are listed in the information below. Yeah, so you can use them and it will help you speak better especially if you practice out loud. So if, you, if your goal is to speak, always practice out loud. Okay, until the next time.